Well, it was small, but it was well proportioned. <laughs> that is your excuse for everything. It was a bit close to the bar. Maybe we should go back to plan A. They're staying here. Uh, Steve, we live next door to a pub. Either way, she's allowed to have a social life. I'm paying for her to have an education, not a hangover. Well, I quite liked it. Maybe we should go back with Amy if she's talking to us. She'll come round. What's that? What's it say? It's from Amy. She's gone. She's moved in with Jacob. I don't even know the address. I'll text it to you. What's it like? It's nice. Basic, but, but nice. And how are you going to pay for that? Jacob already affords it on his own. Are you still going to uni? Yeah. Nothing's changed except where I live. Amy, everything's changed. Please just come home. Mum, I'm sorry, but I'm not coming back. Why not? Because... Because today, someone from my own family insulted me. Right? Then you and Dad didn't believe me. And then when the truth came out, Dad didn't defend me. So, when Dad told me to choose between Jacob and my family... I chose the only person who stood up for me today. I'm sorry, Mum, but I need to go. You OK? What did you say to her? What happened to reverse psychology? Well, it wasn't working, was it? So I improvised. By giving her an ultimatum? I didn't give her an ultimatum. I gave her a choice between two different things. Steve, I am going to find the biggest dictionary my dad owns and I'm going to whack you over the head with it. You've turned Jacob into forbidden fruit, which is exactly what you warned me not to do. Well, maybe this is the eye-opener that she needs. Oh, I can't wait for this one. How is moving into a grotty bedsit with a drug dealer ever going to be a good idea? Because she is moving into a grotty bedsit with a drug dealer. It's shine will soon wear off. Oh, it's romantic. Him and her against the world. Who thinks like that? I did. When I moved into a grotty bedsit above a takeaway in Hackney with a bloke I hardly knew. Oh, Robert, that didn't last, did it? Uh, it lasted six years, Steve. And Robert was a good guy. Can you imagine the damage somebody like Jacob could do in six years? She's gonna ruin her life. Yeah. And it's all your fault. <laughs>